In this video, I'll be looking at present value. We have two projects, project one and project two. In both projects, we have an initial investment of 100K and we have a series of cash flows. The question is, which one do we pick? One way to pick the project is to calculate the net present value of the project. To do that, click in A14 equals. The argument that Excel uses for net present value is NPV. Open in parenthesis. The rate is 5% and note that this is an interest rate which you will get for risk-free investments. Uh, for example, fixed deposits or treasury bonds or it could be anything else. And because in this example this is an annual interest rate, we need to divide it by 12 to get the monthly rate, comma, the cash flows, close the parenthesis and add back the initial investment and hit enter. And we get the answer of 48k. So we'll repeat the same for, the, for investment number 2 equals NPV open a parenthesis, rate is 5% and because the interest is compounded monthly we divide it by 12 comma provide Excel with the cash flows close a parenthesis and add back the initial investment and hit enter. Because project, project 2 has a higher NPV we should pick this project however we also need to take into account risk associated with projects and another thing that you really need to note is that the projects that you're comparing should have um, cash flows uh, which are same so they, they need to occur at the same time so if investment one has cash flow at time one investment two should also have a cash flow at time two Similarly, the third cash flow should, for investment one should occur at time three, and for investment two, it should occur at time three as well. You get the idea.